Today we do something that I have never done before. Something that I probably should have done before as a roguelike content creator. We're gonna play the roguelike that started it all. The thing that is the like. This is Rogue, a game that came out in 1985 and defined the roguelike genre as being an ASCII-based dungeon crawler. Uh, turn-based, all of the things that make up a, a traditional roguelike. Now the roguelike genre has expanded and changed over the past 40 years at this point. We now have things that are roguelites, we have deck builders, we have all kinds of wacky roguelike games. But this is the beginning, Rogue, a game that came out in 1985 and we're gonna play it today. Uh, and it's not going to go well. <laughs> it's not going to go well, and we're going to see uh, just how much games have, have aged in the last 40 years. So this is us. You can see me with the little smiley face in, in the top right now. There's certain indicators all over the, the current room that we're in. Each green dot is a location I can move to, um, and the other things that are on the, the ground are items we can pick up or enemies that we have to kill. In this case, the H is a giant hobgoblin that is probably going to murder me in, in mere moments, whereas that little yellow thing to my left is some gold that I'm going to pick up and then carry. We're going to be going back and forth between uh, this screen, the entire game, which you get to by pressing F1. This is basically a list of all of the commands that exist inside of Rogue, and there's quite a few of them. Uh, and I've been doing my best to study to make sure that I don't look like an idiot. But the reality is that I'm going to look like an idiot, and we're probably not going to get anywhere close to winning a run in this game, as it's also a ridiculously hard game. So, uh, we'll see what we can do. Let's, let's pick up the gold. I have found 44 gold pieces. That's very exciting. And now I'm going to attempt to kill this hobgoblin. So you can see in the bottom, uh, we have hits. That's our, our HP currently. So I can take 12 hits. Uh, and our strength is 16. Now, I don't know if I can examine this hobgoblin at all and, and learn anything about him. It, it doesn't really appear that I can in any way, shape, or form. So I'm probably just going to hit him and, and see what happens. So I missed the Hobgoblin, fantastic. Uh, and it has injured me, it has hit me for four. That's not a great start. I proceeded to not hit him again. It's a, a chance-based system, I have been hit. I took a, another bit of damage. I did hit him and I have defeated him. Um, and that is a great day for me. Now, we also have uh, the ability to regen our HP, uh, and that happens just by moving through the dungeon. Um, I can also just rest, uh, and we would recover some, some HP by resting, but you can see that our, our hits have, have gone up. So I'm going to do some exploration. That green blinking thing is the staircase. This is what gets us uh, to the next floor of the dungeon. Whether or not that's intelligent for us to do right now, it probably makes more sense for us to continue to try to find things. Uh, this, of course, being a complete dead end. <laughs> so we will turn around and go back. What the frick is going on in here, brother? Okay, I need to get the heck out, I think. I got frozen by a blast of frost from the ice monster. Um, the bat has injured me. The bat has hit me. Um, the bat has hit me. It has injured me, uh, it whizzes by me, the frost bounces, it hits the bat, oh my god, I've defeated the bat. The kestrel swings and hits me, I'm frozen this entire time, I can't do anything. I can move again. Okay, get me the frick out of here, okay? I, I think that at this point, I've been frozen. <laughs> I'm gonna die, okay? Uh, kestrel scored an excellent hit on me, it has injured me, uh, and I have died. So, we lasted uh, approximately a minute. Uh, in this today, which is fantastic. Um, I've been I've been obliterated, just absolutely destroyed. You can see that I, I've attempted a, a couple of of runs here. Let's start a new game, and and let's go back in again. I'm going to be Olanky once more, and we're going to see if possibly we can do better than uh, losing immediately. Which you have to imagine that we might be able to to do better than than losing immediately. So take me down into here. It's a big old empty room, which is none too fantastic for me. We'll go this way. It's a big old empty room. I don't, to be honest with you, I really don't mind these big old empty rooms. So we do have a Kestrel, uh, and we, we got our butt kicked by a Kestrel in the, the previous one. I have scored an excellent hit and destroyed it. That's some great news. Give me some gold. We got 60 gold pieces. 
I don't necessarily know what gold does. That is a bat, okay? Um, that bat probably gonna hit me is, is a, a fair assessment of the situation. The bat is very erratic in his movement. And I am not appreciating him. Okay, oh, frick, it's another ice monster, brother. I can't... I can't, uh, I can't kill you. Just kidding, I killed you. <laughs> He's crazy. I've achieved the rank of the guild novice. Okay, the bat's gotta go, man. I got a ton of, uh, stats, man. I keep missing the bat. This bat is ridiculous. I've defeated the bat. Okay. Dude, look at our, look at our stats on the bottom. We, we have increased to, uh, having 21 possible hit points, which is very good. I think that that's solid. What is this? Two rations of food. Okay, I know that there is a food system in the game. Um, I do not know how to do- Hello, Mr. Hobgoblin. I guess I'll, I'll attempt to kill you. Uh, I've hit him. I've defeated him. I've achieved the rank of apprentice. Dude, my stats, they're quite high at the current moment in time. I'm feeling good about this. I also want to, to take a look at my inventory real quick. So this is what I currently have on me. I got two rations of food. Uh, I got one ring mail, which is an armor class five. I'm wearing that. Uh, I'm also using a mace, a weapon right now, a plus one plus one. I don't necessarily know what that means, but that's okay. Uh, and I got a short bow and some arrows. We probably would want to equip the bow if we're going to try to handle some enemies at range. Just as a, a logical conclusion, that is what a bow does. Um, so if we, we find ourselves in a position, this is our exit. <laughs> if we find ourselves in a position where we think it may be valuable to switch to the bow, we can do that. I would like to try to hit the bat. I've defeated the bat. At this point, you gotta, you gotta kill the Kestrel, okay? Great work. So that's our exit. Um, there is still one room we haven't explored. Let's ignore it, okay? I'm gonna pick up a, a scroll that's titled Neck Debt Foy. That's, that's nice. Um, I am going to read this. So we are going to read this scroll titled Neck Debt Foy. Um, as I read the scroll, it vanishes. I hear maniacal laughter in the distance. Okay, what do you want to call it? This is the maniacal... Did I already spell that wrong? Maniacal scroll. I have no clue what maniacal uh, voices in the distance are. But it makes me feel like I should probably get the frick out of the floor, is a, a logical conclusion. That's a Kestrel. Brother, I'm gonna leave, okay? I'm going down the staircase, goodbye. Uh, get a little bit deeper, baby. Now, that's probably our staircase back up. Is that accurate? No. <laughs> that went right back down again. So now I'm on level three. Okay. Terrifying. I got caught in the bear trap. That's pretty bad. I'm still stuck in the bear trap. I'm still stuck in the bear trap. I'm still stuck in the bear trap. Please let me leave. Okay. At least we know. At least we know there's a bear trap there. <laughs> that seems like a, a nice, nice thing to have learned. What do you think an eye is? I'm gonna try to kill it. Um, it's the ice monster. Honestly, I scored an excellent hit on it and destroyed it. So far, he's kind of cracked. The emu doesn't hit you. Okay, brother, why the hell is there an emu in the dungeon? I've achieved the rank of journeyman. I continue to rank up like crazy right now. And I'm feeling good about it. This Kestrel does not stand a chance, um, except for that part where it does stand a chance just kidding it doesn't i'll take my money i'd like some loot at some point i feel like i'm i'm doing oh it's dark in this room oh and we have found our our exit i think i need to find some loot okay i went down to level three we've skipped level two um i think it would probably be valuable i'm gonna fight the damn ice monster okay i've defeated him i'm i'm too strong at this point when we got this much health, yeah, see, this is what I'm, I'm looking for right now. Um, we got ourselves a brown potion. Now, I can quaff this potion and figure out what it, it does. So let's, let's do it, okay? I feel stronger. That has given me an extra strength. I don't know if that lasts forever, uh, but I'm, I'm happy to have it at the current moment in time. I feel like there may be some stuff over here, and there is. I have a scroll titled 
vivid, Cav. Okay, I hit the bat, I defeat the bat. We might as well read the scroll. So it's a scroll titled Fived Cav. I read the scroll, it vanishes. Your armor faintly glows for a moment. What do you want to call this? This is the, the armor glower. And it seems that that has increased my armor uh, to level 6 instead of level 5, which is very exciting. I have killed the hobgoblin that has attempted to, to come over and just shank me. Um, I go this way. Dude, I want to explore this entire dungeon right now. Um, that bat is not a concern to me. I've killed a bat that was in this hallway. Uh, and we get some gold. That's fine. This is completely fine. It's time for me to get out. Okay, I would like to leave. Um, level 3 ended up being a, a bit of a... Bit of a mess, but uh, you know what? We walk out of it with some decent stuff. Bats, just frick off. I scored an excellent hit on the bat. I've defeated him. Um, I'd like to leave. Level four, ladies and gentlemen. I'm pretty sure I have to go through 26 floors. <laughs> so a uh, little bit of, of time before we pull that off. Um, I defeated the Hobgoblin. I think he forgot he was alive for a little bit. That's that's great news for me. Okay, um, there's our exit. That's good. If we run into some messy stuff, such as this ice monster, we could just leave. Um, there's a new scroll titled Nuyak Nakoi Zaf. Okay, I'd like to read you. What do you do? As you read the scroll, it vanishes. This scroll is an identify scroll. Okay, select an item to identify. Uh, and all my stuff is identified, brother. So I'd like to identify my scroll of identify, and it's a scroll of identify. What a what a wild scenario. Um, I've scored an excellent hit on the ice monster, destroyed it, and achieved the rank of adventurer. Give me, give me my 38 HP. I'm, I'm living a good life. Very dark in this room. Um, could be dangerous for sure. I have another scroll of identify. That's actually good. So if we can get ourselves some new loot, we can use the scroll of identify to figure out what it is. Um, and perhaps we could do that on like the next potion we find as well. This room is cleared out. The dark rooms, man. Oh, there's, I'm. There's a hallway of emus right here. Okay, get get these emus the heck out of here. Don't want to deal with them. All right, what, what do you got down here? Anything of value? You got a kestrel? Okay, I've injured it. I've defeated it. What is this? A long sword. Okay, this is very exciting. So now, <laughs> now I have to consult my, my guide because I want to identify this long sword. Okay, um, and how do I do that? It's a fantastic question. It's such a good question. Um, we are going to, we are going to, we are going to go to our inventory and hope for the best. I think that that's a great way to do things. So the scroll of identify, that did not do anything. Okay, um, that just allows me to do that. Can I, can I perhaps do, I mean, I can equip the long sword. But I don't necessarily want to do that without knowing what the long sword is, right? So I'd like to equip my my mace again for right now. How the heck do I identify something if I have the scroll of identify? It's a difficult situation, ladies and gentlemen. This is this is why um when eventually the the wild world known as the computer mouse was uh, invented. It made it a lot easier to, to do this kind of stuff. Uh, dude, I have no clue how to identify this. We could read it. I don't think that's how it works, though. I can also throw something, which is an interesting... And find something. How do I find something? Seems like a, a unique idea, for sure. Um... Very strange. I, I guess I will just continue for right now. Because that's my inventory. But I can't do anything with it. <laughs> so I'm just kind of... Th this allows... Th this is my armor. This is my... Uh, I just took off my armor. I'd like to put back on my armor, please. Um, just try and try to do all the things that I can do. Um, let's, let's maybe read. Here we go. Scroll of identify. As you read the scroll, it vanishes. This scroll is an identify scroll. Here we go. I'd like to identify the long sword. It's a plus zero plus zero. This is why you don't equip weapons that you find. Ladies and gentlemen, we had the worst possible scenario. I have defeated the ice monster. 
I now have a short bow. Okay. Um, who knows? That short bow may be a thousand times better than uh, the short bow that I had before that I haven't used yet. So have that be uh, what it is. I've defeated the Kestrel. Brother, I feel like very strong. I'm defeating stuff immediately right now. There's some there's some dark rooms in here, but we we clearing. All right, we clearing. Let let's get out of here. We we've seen the entire floor. Um, definitely a chance for some enemies to to pop out of nowhere. But I'm I'm oh we have not discovered the entire floor. Hello, what what do we got going on in here? This is gonna be a dead end. You son of a gun. <laughs> you you little you little freak rogue. Okay. Um, defeat another Kestrel? Take me down to the next floor. I could leave immediately. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Okay. Um, interesting. Let's, let's eat. I'm gonna eat a ration of food, uh, and now I am no longer hungry. I, I have a feeling that maybe when we're, we're hungry, we would get weakened. That just seems like a, a logical conclusion to me. Dude, these bats are... They're absolutely the worst enemy in the game, for sure. It's another short bow. I'm gonna need another like 80 scrolls of identify just to figure out what all these short bows do, but that's that's a problem for another day at this point. Just let me live my life. Found a scroll ca oh, called Armor Glower. That's very exciting. This allows me to uh, this allows me to get more armor. And I'm up to seven now. Uh, Ice monster obliterated. You love to see it. Roguelike games have gotten a lot more exciting over the years. I just want to come out there uh, right now and say it. Uh, this is an orc. Okay, the orc swings and misses. I swing and miss. It's injured me. It's only hit me for two, which is not too bad. I barely miss the orc. He barely misses me. I hit him. I obliterated him. That's great news. And then I hit the ice monster. I obliterate him too. Leather armor. Okay, so now we now we got multiple armor. I, I got the the ring mail is a plus three, which is pretty good to be honest. The leather armor we got no clue. If I get a scroll of identify, perhaps I picked up another ration of food. Very great room that that we were just in there. This is why you do the explorer uh, instead of goodbye. I've achieved the rank of fighter. I got forty eight HP. I don't want to jump the gun, but I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty freaking good about our chances on this one hobgoblin goodbye you you have no reason to exist here slime swings and hits you how the hell does a slime swing brother i hit the slime i injured the slime i defeated the slime i found some gold okay gold continues to rise we got 929 uh who knows at some point that 929 I'm, I'm gonna send that home to my family uh, when I escape the war and, and it's gonna be a, a lovely time. Honestly, the slime divides. Oh no, I'm, I'm, in, a, I'm in tough shape, brother. Okay, slime is dead. There's another slime. I gotta kill the Kestrel, okay? I gotta kill the Kestrel, I'm gonna die. Kestrel's dead, now slime. This slime is, he's, he's a messy boy. I do not like this, this splitting slime. Okay, it's time to go. Get, get me get me out of here. There's a bat chasing me and I have no interest. A crimson potion. I will I will waff you. This tastes great. It makes you feel warm all over. What do you want to call it? This is a uh, warm boy. <laughs> I, I don't I don't know. okay? It's a warm potion. I don't know what any of these do. You think an L is a lion? You've injured the leprechaun. okay yeah, couldn't have been further off to be honest. Um, he swings and misses. I've injured, I've defeated, and he had 311 gold on him. They say to look at the end of a rainbow. Apparently, you just gotta look in the middle of a, an ASCII art dungeon to accomplish your, your life goals um, or just get rich. There's our exit, which to be honest, this floor is very dark and I don't like it. Um, I defeated an ice monster, which is exciting. Got a little bit of gold. Dude, I don't wanna be here. This, this dark is very dark. And, and dark tends to be, oh, look at this, a connector, the piece we needed all along. Okay, there's a Kestrel, there's also a, a potion, get defeated. Um, potion of gain strength, I would like to uh, immediately quaff the hell out of you, give me them bulging muscles, my strength goes up to 18, 
we continue to get stronger and stronger. There's an area we haven't explored. I'm going to tell you. Just take me down. Fight the Leprechaun. I swing and hit. He swings and misses. I injured him. I've defeated him. 50 gold? Brother, you're failing at being a Leprechaun. It's another potion of strength. Holy. Quaff ya. Potion me. Strong me. It's a great day. It's a, it's a lovely, lovely, beautiful day. Okay, the orc has hit me for eight. Um, and I have hit him for a million because I'm the greatest to ever do it is, is what I'm, I'm thinking. Okay. A lot of potential exits here. I'd like to go down. All right. I'd like to go down. It's a dark floor. It's a very dark floor. I've defeated an orc, a plaid potion. Okay. We have no clue what the plaid potion does. We do have an exit as well very very exciting day i don't want to be here <laughs> but let's explore a little bit but this floor appears to be kind of messy and i i think we should just go okay i think we should just go let let's oh what the frick okay you know what it's a good time to quaff a potion maybe it lights up the room i begin to feel much better i think that was probably a full health uh it's it's messy Ooh, the equator? <laughs> the aquator? Your armor weakens. Oh my. He hits me, my armor weakens again. I hit him, he injures me, my armor weakens. Brother, what the hell is going on? Why are you weakening my armor so much? My armor's down to two. You're not doing any damage to me, but you have weakened my armor to, like, nothing. This is a problem. This is a big issue. My armor is now two. Well, there's our exit. Um, feel like we probably need to prioritize finding some armor now because I'm in a tough spot. There's a rattlesnake on this floor. Okay. You feel a bite in your leg and now you feel weaker. My strength has gone down. Okay, he's injured me. Brother, I'm dying the rattlesnake. Okay, they ain't messing around on this floor and I, I respect it. If, if we want to accomplish greatness, we, we need to... Uh, we need, we need to improve. I scored an excellent hit on the zombie. Brother, there's zombies, there's rattlesnakes, there's hobgoblins. Luckily, I'm defeating a lot of them before it happens. I'm gonna kill you. It's a rattlesnake again, brother. I hit him, I've defeated him. My health is in shambles. I think this is a good opportunity for us to... I'm hungry. Just just wait. We, we can hit period and it will just, uh, it'll just wait. I'm gonna recover a little bit of HP. And then my intention here is probably that we will move forward a little bit and then pop some food. Okay? I, I think this is good. I'm, I'm back up. Where the heck am I? Did I just fall down a damn hole or something? I now have three rations of food. Why is there a rattlesnake in this hole, brother? Okay. I'm, I'm going to attempt to kill this rattlesnake first. Things are getting messy. I, I fell down a damn hole and now I'm... I'm I don't know where I am. Everything's a mess. I should probably eat. I think that that's a valid thing to do. Yum, that tasted good. Damn straight it did. Frost whizzes by you. Frost bounces. Frost hits the ice monster. I think an ice monster just killed himself when I walked in this room. Which is way better than it killing me. Let me tell you. I got a scroll titled Tab Yak Your Pavlov. As one does. Okay? As one does. Should I read it? I'm gonna read it. As you read the scroll, it vanishes. Feels as if somebody is watching over you. What do you call it? This is, uh, this is Big Brother? Is, is Big Brother. And hopefully, they, they toss me some armor. Because, I'm gonna tell you, we're pretty weak with only two armor. The, the Aquator ruined my life in, in very quick succession. Okay, I'm on a damn journey in this tunnel, man. Where the heck are we going? To nothing. You love to see it. <laughs> you love to see it. Can take me back. Oh, frick me. He's back. Okay. You gotta die, brother. Luckily, I don't think my armor can go any lower than, than what it is. Okay, I have ranked up, which is exciting. This is going right back to the damn door. A strange white mist envelops you and you fall asleep. Okay, I think that was a trap. I think I can identify traps, but brother, I'm not identifying every every damn 
spot on the floor. I, I got, look, the Olympics are coming up next year and I don't want to miss them. Um, zombie defeated. Take me down, I suppose. I've made it to level 10. I'm considering this a massive win. This Aquator can go freak himself, okay? I'm, I'm very disappointed in his existence. He exists solely to make me sad at this point. A uh, little bit more food is nice. I'm in a bear trap. <laughs> Frick the bear trap, man. Frick the bear trap. Okay, take me on my way. I have found my exit. I have hit the leprechaun. My purse feels lighter. You son of a gun. The leprechaun up and damn vanished. Oh, you're, you're gonna... There's hell to pay, for sure. Defeated an ice monster over here. Just keep, keep me going, okay? Uh, what do you think a C is? I'll hit you. It's a centaur. That seems bad. Okay. Oh, dude, he's hitting me. He's hitting me for a lot. I have defeated him, but we gotta be careful. Okay. We gotta be careful. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of scared. Our armor. Oh no. Rattlesnakes are not what I wanted to see. I'm glad I killed it in one hit and got a little lucky, but we need, uh, I got an excellent hit on the orc too, man. I'm getting very lucky. I got a zircon ring. Okay, um, we gotta learn how to put rings on. P to put on a ring. Okay, it's a zircon ring. Left hand or right hand? Uh, left. I'm now wearing it on my left hand. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully, I I now have the power of of zircon, which is uh probably the worst convention I've ever been to. There's a door here. Take me up. Brother, I need I need some juice. And I'm starting to get afraid that I ain't getting no juice. Why are all these floors so freaking uh, dark, huh? These people not invent electricity? Clearly, I'm playing a game that uh, needed electricity to run. Um, I suppose I could equip the wand, but I don't really want to equip a wand that I, I have no clue what it does. What if the wand has a, a tag on it that just says uh, self-destruct? And then I, I take it and then I die. That would be that would be horrible so i'm just not going to do it i walked i walked right into the bear trap <laughs> that time that time i respect it i walked right into the bear trap that's that's my b okay that's my b take me this way okay i've hit an excellent hit on the orc brother i think we're in we're in like a massive loot zone i now have a brass wand a potion of strength i i would like to quaff my potion please what bulging muscles i'm gonna die okay the the nymph is hitting me she stole my bow that's kind of life at this point um centaur is dead rattlesnakes here there's a yeti in here uh i need to leave i'm dead <laughs> okay you got me um you got me i respect it I was killed by a yeti. Of all the things to get killed by, I think that a, a yeti is a, a completely respectable one to get killed by. I don't think I did that bad. I mean, we made it to like floor 11 or 12 or something. That's halfway through the game. Seems like a, a great, great accomplishment in my eyes. But this is Rogue. The the original roguelike game. Hopefully you enjoyed. You can play this for yourself um, pretty much anywhere on the internet. Uh, it is available. I'm playing the version that is on Steam. Uh, although after reading the reviews previously, uh, apparently the people that posted this on Steam stole the game uh, from the original developers and put it on Steam to make a profit. So maybe don't recommend uh, downloading this one on Steam as you can find it on uh, about a thousand different websites around the internet. So best of luck to you. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, liking the video, much appreciated. I will see you in the next roguelike video. Goodbye.